All right, guys, what's going on? Welcome in. So we have some breaking Jets news that just came out a couple minutes ago. It's looking like the team is adding to their interior offensive line, which, in my opinion, is absolutely massive, right? I feel like I've been pounding on the table, solidify the offensive line. You know, if the Jets are in a position where they're going to be taking on Aaron Rodgers' contract, they're going to be trading away draft picks, uh, potentially a player, to go land a 40-year-old quarterback in Aaron Rodgers, we don't know how much time left he has, um, you know, in the NFL. <laughs> in his words, he was 90-10 as far as retirement and playing goes before the darkness retreat. You know, this season should not be a wash. We got to solidify this offensive line. I want a bulletproof O-line. But with that said, the Jets are bringing in guard slash center, former Falcon and commander, spent three seasons with each team. Wes Schweitzer, okay, at 29 years old, six foot five, 300 pounds. He is experienced playing at multiple positions, left guard and right guard, a little bit of center in there as well. This is the type of signing that I, I, I want the Jets to make. Right. This to me is a good signing because not only is he 29 years old and he provides uh, some experience, some veteran experience, according to Rich Samini, he actually has 60 starts under his belt and did start every game as a rookie for Atlanta. But in the event that he that the right guard goes down, right, AVT goes down, if somebody else gets hurt, he can fill in. He, he's a versatile player here, and that's super, super important. When I'm looking at the roster currently, the Jets don't have a, you know, a guaranteed center on the roster. Nate Harabig signed a multi-year contract with the Steelers, a guy who I really, really like. Dan Feeney's gone down to Miami, joining Mike White. Uh, you know, I'm looking at the rest of the O-line here. Makai Becton's coming back from a season-ending injury. Dwayne Brown is coming back from, you know, what he was going through with his shoulder. Max Brown is, uh, Max Mitchell is coming back from what he was dealing with, which wasn't necessarily an injury. I believe it was blood clots. So, you know, in AVT, coming back from a season-ending injury. There's a lot of talent here. The Jets have guys, but the question mark is health. So, again, looping this back into Aaron Rodgers here, I want to be safe. I don't want to be, you know, sorry <laughs> at the end of the day. Yeah, it's awesome to go invest money in pass catchers. I know there's there's been some talk about potentially adding OBJ, but if it was up to me, I'm, re I'm investing a lot of money trying to get a lot of talent. S to solidify this O-line. So anyway, I love the move. The contract information has not been released yet, but let me know your thoughts down below in the, uh, down below in the comment section. Thanks so much for watching. And as always, go Jets. Mm -hmm.